Hey guys, Dubbers of Gaming here. Welcome back to another episode of LSPDFR. Today we are going to be out here in Nye County Sheriff's Department in Nevada, continuing with the Nevada theme. You already know. Last episode we were out with NHP. Today we're going to get out here in some Nye County. Next episode, I'm kind of going to debate whether or not to do Nye County or go back to NHP, or maybe do another county in Nevada. Let me know. Um, let me know in the comments down below what you are, what your thoughts are on that. But we have this beautiful vehicle here by uh, Jules Winfield on LSPD Far. It is not currently released. I do not know if he plans on releasing it or not. Uh, but yeah, it is very, very nice. It is absolutely gorgeous all around. It is very accurate to the real life cars uh, in real life. And uh, just take a look at it real quick. Very, very nice. Um, they do use this older light bar, and they also use the new wheel and light bar, and we do have both of those Crown Vicks in games. So we might see another one of those. Well, probably not. It's in the police force slot. So if you guys want to see the uh, uh, newer style version of the Vic here with the newer light bar, let me know in the comments down below as well, and I'll be happy to do it. But definitely, definitely beautiful all around. Lighting setup is perfect, as uh, what you can see on live PD and stuff. Again, same interior. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful all around. Love it. But like I said, not released, and uh, I don't know if he plans on releasing it or not, but it is uh, definitely amazing. So, this is, like I said, the other Vic, so maybe we'll use that here in the future. But I'm trying to find other things that they use besides Vicks and 09 chargers, and I can't really find any 09 chargers with this light bar. Uh, and they also use a new one with the uh, newer light bar, the Liberty, I believe it is. But I really can't find that one either, uh, one that will resemble it good enough. So they use a lot of trucks, and I believe they use a Durango, which I can do. Uh, I think I'll be able to make that work, so we'll see. And uh, that'll be that. So we'll do a couple more episodes here in Nevada, and then we'll go and change it up, probably to some miscellaneous stuff, and then we'll head on over to Arizona for our next state. But that'll be that. Uh, let's get out here in the county today. Uh, the main area we're kind of going off of uh, is Parump, and I believe I'm saying that right, Parump, in uh, Nye County. All right, dude, relax. Okay, I guess you're just gonna come too. Hey, come on, dude. I'm not sure if the siren is correct. Um, I really haven't looked actually to see if it is correct or not, but it is the same one that we've been using for LVMPD as well as uh, uh, HP. So. That is that, but that's where we're really going to be today here is in Sandy Shores. Uh, again, kind of an area that resembles uh, Nye County the best, I would say. And uh, that is that. We're going to be 10 for one 10 8 see what we can go and get into today. Oh, save the wolves. See if we can uh, get any uh, anything going on out here in Nye County today. And uh, that'll be that. It's very weird to see the train coming by. <laughs> but uh, yeah, there you go. Love it. What are we going to get into today? One out of one, show me 1041, 10 8. Oh, also forgot to mention, we changed out our callouts, so we have all new callouts in. Uh, got rid of every single old one that we had in, and now we have all brand new ones, so that will be that. Let's get it going. Right now, we're getting reports of a welfare check. It's going to be uh, a couple blocks down the way here. We're going to head over that way, see what we got going on. Welfare checks can really be anything, just, you know, neighbors calling in, or family or friends, or anything like that, just worried about uh, another loved one, or a friend, or whatever. Uh, so we'll go and head over there and see if we got anything going on. Make sure that everyone is okay. Looks like it's gonna be here at uh, one of these houses. So we're gonna park just a little bit away down the road. Uh, I think it's gonna be in this abandoned house, actually. I do have uh, eyes on one individual here. We're going to go and pull over right here. And uh, we'll be out. One and one. I'm going to be out westbound Algonquin Boulevard near uh, a couple of abandoned structures. Going to have one occupant in the side. I believe it's going to be the individual we're looking for today. I could also not find a uh, correct uh, Nye County uniform. No one has anything made. So I kind of put together something with the existing EUP stuff. I think it looks pretty good. All right. Yes, sir. How's it going, Sheriff's Department? How you doing, man? What you doing over here? Um, boss is worried about you. Everything okay? This is the right way. Is this the right way to Sandy Shores? We're in Sandy Shores right now, or Nye County. We're in Nye County right now. Oh, that's all you got for me? Okay. Uh, do you have ID on you? 
You have ID on you, proof insurance? Not proof insurance. I wow. <laughs> just need your ID. Get ID on you? I like Thanks. to stay behind this wall. Alright. Britt Mason, we'll go and run that through dispatch this time. Uh, dispatch, if I can get a uh, 1027, 1029 on a Britt Mason. Common spelling, gonna be mail 42176. Uh, Alright. So that's that's all you got, man? I don't know. What are you, what are you doing out here? Waiting for a friend? Okay. Yeah, like I said, man, your boss called in. He's good. He doesn't have any warrants or anything. Your boss called in. Uh, just say you didn't come to work today or anything, so... Where are you coming from? You do not have the right to answer? Okay, I'm just trying to see what's going on here, man. Do you have anything illegal on you or anything like that? Any guns or anything? You want me to check? Alright, well... Uh, I think I'll go and do that here at this time, but... You don't drink alcohol? Alright, well, if you want to go and turn around, I'm just gonna go and pat you down real quick for my safety, okay? Just to make sure you're all good. I'm sure you are, man. Just want to make sure, okay? If he's got anything on him here, then we'll go from there. But, uh, yeah, I mean, he does have a crack pipe. All right, well, I mean, I can work with a crack pipe, ma'am. I just want to make sure that you're you're doing good out here, okay? So, I'd recommend calling your boss and uh, making sure that, you know, he knows what's going on and everything like that. And, you know, I'm not going to get into your business or whatever and just make sure that you're, you know, being careful and all that, okay? Um, so I'm not going to give you the crack pipe ba back, but I'm going to sees it from you but you know um just not gonna give you a citation or whatever so just you know get on out of here you can't be in this area and uh that'll be that okay would you like me to get you a taxi or something or like an uber well, I'll be damned. no what do you want to do you don't want to leave he's not gonna leave oh there you go oh i gotta issue him a warning on here i think there you all go all right off you go all right. Sounds good, man. Thank you very much. I appreciate the cooperation, okay? All right. Well, we're going to have him get on out of here. He really shouldn't be in this area. It looks like there's a couple squatters or homeless people around this area as well. So just going to make sure that, you know, he's being safe and looks like he, he had a crack pipe on him. So I just want to make sure he's not getting into stuff that he shouldn't be. You know, I'm not here to get into his personal life or whatever. Just to make sure that he's okay because his boss is worried about him so you know told him to call his boss and that's really the extent of uh what we can kind of do here so we're gonna go and uh, be code four off that now dispatch I'm gonna have the uh individual oh there you go yeah contact your boss like i said man all right have a good day uh subject has been notified to uh contact his boss and uh we're gonna be code four on that now we're getting reports of an indecent exposure. Uh, looks like it's gonna be at the Yellow Jack, I believe. So we're gonna head over there right now. I'm actually just gonna flip a Yui right here. We'll go and head down there and see what we got. So, at the Yellow Jack, kind of leading me to oh, kind of leading me to uh, believe might have some intoxication involved. So whenever I get there, I'm gonna go and call an additional unit. Just to, uh, just for my security and safety and everyone else around us at the bar, so just gonna make sure that, uh, we're gonna be good to go on that and, um, we'll go from there. But, especially, you know, drunk, combative people really do not want to be dealing with it, so we're gonna go and pass this guy when we had the chance. We'll cross over there, keep it all 100% legal. All right, so we'll go and be over here now and uh, see what we got. Got a pursuit going on back there. Wish there was a way to disable that. I'm sure there is, but dispatch, I'm gonna be on scene at this time, rolling up to the gas station or the bar correction. Jesus, dude. I'm gonna have one individual out here. I believe this is going to be the uh, witness. Hey, sir, you called 911. All right, I'm gonna go and park the car. No, 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 no. Oh my God, what did I say? Oh shit, I must have said like serious or something, and she thought I was talking to her, and <laughs> she's about to fucking call 911, dude. God, I hate that. Okay, I said, hey sir, that's what, that's all I said, dude. That's what she got. Ridiculous. All right.
Dispatch him out with the suspect at this time. The witness. Alright. It might be on this guy. I'm not sure. What do we got going on, guys? You called? 911? <laughs> what do you have to say? What's going on? Dick's out for Harambe. Oh my god. Okay. Um. Anyone? Who? Who's the one that called here? Are you the one that called? Who am I talking to? Dylan? Alright, who are you? You're Dylan. I want to talk to... That's all you have to say to me? Okay. So, there we go. Now I want to talk to this guy. Uh, tell me what you saw. So, these cars keep, like, stopping and going over to them, and it's, like, flash their bits, you know? I think they might be, like, a prostitute? Isn't that gross? Okay, can you point out the person? That's a scumbag right there. Okay, the guy behind you. Okay, <clears throat> if you want to go and get me your uh, identification real quick, we'll go and just mark this down for our reports and I'll have a chat with this guy. The possible prostitution. These guys suspended, but that's alright. Lamar Davis. Alright, sit tight for me. How's it going, sir? What do you have to say? What's going on? Dick's for, out for Harambe. That's, that's all you got? I mean, that's, you know, how long ago has that been now? Okay, uh, do you have an ID on you? See if we can talk to him a little bit more in here. He's got some slurred speech. Okay. You been drinking it all today, man? Of course. I need to warm my body. All right. What are you doing out here? Mind your own business? Oh, well, man, I'm just out here. Some people called 911 on you, so I'm just making sure that uh, everything is good. Where are you coming from today? From home? All right. Are you heading out, or what are you doing? Where are you going after this? You don't, I don't want to know. Okay. Everything illegal on you I need to know about? Nothing illegal on me. Alright, if you want to go, just go and turn around for a second. I'm going to go and patch you down real quick just for my safety and yours, okay? Make sure you don't have any weapons or anything like that on you. Did I already run his information? I don't remember if I did or not. If you didn't, I'll go and run it here. Not that he's good. I think I did. But he's good on that. Alright, yeah, so he's all good there, but... I don't know what's going on, man, but, you know, I don't have any hard evidence to really go off of on here except this guy's word of just saying that they're doing this, they're doing that. More of a he said, she said type thing here, but, um, you know, if this place had cameras or anything, I could go and check that, but that's not a an option right now, so. I really don't have anything on him. Um, I mean, he's, he does have his slurred speech and all that, so, I mean, we could breathalyze him. You want to go and take this breathalyzer test here? You consent to that? Yeah? Alright, let's see here. Alright, go and blow in this tube for me. Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. Stop. Appreciate it. Okay, so we could get him for public intoxication. I mean, he's really not doing anything, honestly. Like, there's nothing going on here. Do you have anything else for me, man? I mean... Might be a prostitute. Okay, so he's just saying that guy might be a prostitute because he keeps going up the cars, looking, flashing his bits. So, okay. Alright, well, how about this? Okay, so I have nothing to go off of except your word, okay? And, you know, uh, he's being he's being cool. Sure, he's intoxicated. Now, if this becomes a problem, then I'm going to arrest him for that. But how about if he just leaves the area, then we'll go from there, okay? He's going to leave the area. If you're going to leave the area, sir, without any problems, then we'll be fine. Okay, are you going to be able to do that? you going to be able to leave? How about I actually call you a taxi? I'd rather call you a taxi or an Uber or something to get you out of here since you're intoxicated. Okay? Right. Can we do that? All right. <laughs> I need to get rid of that, dude. I uh, recorded the OBS as well, so... Okay, let's, uh, request escort vehicle. Let's do an Uber. There you go. Alright, just sit tight. I'll get you an Uber, and that'll be that, okay? Damn. Oh, there you go. You already got a taxi. Okay, whatever. I didn't know it was... Oh! <clears throat> nice. Alright, so you're gonna be willing to leave, then? Are we gonna be good with that, then? Or what are we doing? You gonna go with him? I think it might not do that because he's got a new burn route so all right well whatever you want to do i really do not care i just would like you to be out of here okay and don't be doing this stuff anymore if we get any calls about this of you being here doing this kind of stuff then you're going to get arrested okay plain and simple where is the uber 
Oh, it's like, uh, hard getting in here, I guess. You know, what if we, uh, just got him? Can you come here, dude? There you go. Alright, he's good. Okay, so we'll get him out of here then, and, uh, that should be that. Oh my lord, dude, what is wrong with these people? Okay, that works. No. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, there he is. Cool, let's do that. Alright. Thank you again, Lamar. I do appreciate uh, you calling us again. If he's out here again and you're still here, call us again and I'm going to arrest him, okay? That'll be that. So you're good to go. Appreciate it and uh, have a good rest of your day, okay? All right, dispatch, we're going to be code for it this time. Be advised, suspect has been notified that if we get any more complaints on his person, we're going to go ahead and place him in custody, and uh, complaint and has been let go at this time. We're going to be code four on that. Now back to Nate. Panorama Drive. Ooh. Any reports of a vehicle explosion? I did just hear it, actually. We're going to go and light up here and head out there, code three right now. All right, dispatch, I'm responding at this time. Looks like it's going to be uh, right around the same area we were just at, interestingly enough. Right around the loop here. Oh my god, what is going on here? Alright, we're going to be on scene at this time. I got a couple people here. We need to go and get this road just shut down for a second. All right, let's go ahead and get uh, traffic slowed a little bit. All right, let's just do that and see what we got here with this guy. Not sure what this dude's doing, but what do we got going on, sir? Uh, can you please describe what you saw? Uh, the vehicle's on fire and suddenly exploded, okay. Uh, are you hurt or anything and need any medical attention? No? Okay. Uh, provide me a statement for further investigation and all that. Hand you statement. Alright, cool. Thank you very much, man. I appreciate it. Okay, well, uh, that's that. Uh, you're good to go, man. I do appreciate it. I'll go and take care of it from here. Um, you can go and head on out, okay? Hands are shaking. Yeah, probably. Okay, so we're gonna go and get a, uh, a plate check if we can. Yeah, I'm just gonna get a check here on that. Uh, plate check. And then also, if we can get a, uh, tow truck out here. Target what do we want to do plate. here? Six, two, Sam, Robert, William, four, five, zero, a traffic violation. Uh-oh, not letting me tow it. With caution. Is there someone inside? Oh, I see. Okay, we got somebody inside the vehicle. Okay, let's go and get a, uh, EMS out here if we can. <laughs> Drive. Yeah, be advised, we got one individual inside the vehicle. Alright, this is going to be a crime scene now, so we need to get everything shut down. Alright, so let's go ahead and just come back here. I'll work on traffic control. While uh, you guys do what you need to do. That guy's going to sit all the way back there, so that's good. Oh my god. Alright, so we're just going to reroute people over this way. Yeah, there you go. Alright, so that'll be that. I don't know. If they're not going to want to go, that's fine, but... CPR has failed. Alright, so we're going to have one deceased at this time, then. They got him out of the car and everything. So we're going to go and get a uh, corner unit out here. What do we got now? Uh, so much stuff, dude. Corner. Alright, you guys can get on out of here. Go ahead, dude. Oh, okay. We'll go. Somebody go. What are we doing here? Alright. You really are gonna do this now, dude? Go whatever way you want to go. I do not care. Okay, there we go. I do not care. Got it. Ugh, alright, cool. So, that's that. 
Everything's gonna be uh, taken care of here right now. Life is like toilet paper. Long and useful, but always ends at the wrong time. Very true. Uh. I'm killed by the explosion. Okay. Alright, so that's gonna be that. Now I should be able to tow this. Request tow service. We're gonna have to get a flatbed out for this. Alright. So let's go ahead now and remove all the signs. See where these people want to go. I'm gonna try and push this out of the roadway if I can with my vehicle. Ah! Hold on, dude. Too close. God. Alright, so we're gonna see here what I can do with this, but... I'm not sure what I'll be able to do. Tow truck is right there, so... Let's see here. Nah, I doubt it. I'm gonna have to get behind it, if anything. Okay, so let's just see here. There we go. Dude! Come on, dude. I was doing it. Alright, well now this guy's gonna be stuck on it. Tow truck's here, so that's good. We'll go and take it, and that'll be that. I did put it in a custom tow truck, yes. Alright, well we're gonna go and be uh, code 4 on that now. Back to Nate. Any reports of a traffic stop backup right now? Gonna be, uh... Copy that. We're moving right now. Go ahead and Four, check on our that. computer, see what we got here. Um... Let's see here, we got... Oh, that's not what I want, dude. What do I want? Uh, traffic stop requesting assistance here. Um, back up. Situation currently under control. Please respond. Okay, so we just need another unit. They want us to get out their code too, so I'm gonna go no lights, no sirens. And, uh, that'll be that. We'll be out there. But yeah. And, uh, I try to play as realistically as I can. Um, I really do not like it whenever the AI messes it up, but, you know, it's gonna happen. So, I do get questions sometimes, why don't I respond every word, lights and sirens, because it's it's a reality that cops do not respond every single place with their lights and sirens on. You know, now sure, they might, you know, amp it up a little bit in regular driving, they're not going to be, uh, you know, running lights and stuff, but they're going to speed up a little bit, sure. But, you know, they're not going to be, looks like we're on the freeway, actually. But, we don't have to go lights and sirens for, you know, a welfare check, for instance, or... You know, some sort of, uh, I don't know. You know, you just you just kind of know whenever you're not going to need to respond lights and sirens. Like to this. Just a backup. Now, if there were shots fired, yeah, I'm responding code 3, but it's just, you know, a backup on a traffic stop. So, I'm just going to be here assisting. Looks like we got NHP, so for some reason they need my assistance, but, you know, I'm not going to be judging. We'll just get out here right now with them. Let's see what we got. One out of one, I'm going to be on scene out with the officer at this time. Construction trooper. Alright, dude. The lights on this one are messed up. He's taking off at this time. Dude. You can have a vehicle code one at this time. RP code one. Hold the air. Alright, here we go. Oh, God. What are you doing? I'm going to be taking off down this way. Let me go and get... No, full out aggressive, dude. No, no, no. Alright, I'm not going to call in an area... Dude, what are you doing? See, now, this is what I'm talking about. Like, sure, NHP is going to want to take primary, of course, but I'm not going to have that. Like, <laughs> no thank you. you try and come up at me, I bet. Alright, gonna be heading down South Interstate 1 here at this time. Not gonna call in an air unit because they mess up a lot of the times. I don't know if Nye County has an air unit, to be honest. Um, but they shoot sometimes. They shoot, like, every time. I don't really understand it. I gotta figure that out. But whenever I do, then I'll start calling them in some more, but... Alright, gonna be getting through some traffic here at this time. We're gonna be heading over through the mountains right now. Gonna be heading down to Vegas. Uh, he's gonna be entering Vegas pretty soon, so we're gonna want to get uh, all the MPD involved if we can. Still gonna be south on Interstate 1 here. Gonna be cutting through traffic at this time. Alright, we're gonna be at the city limits here for Vegas. Yeah, we just entered Las Vegas here. 
Notify uh, LVMPD if available whenever we get off the freeway here. But we'll still remain with it, you dirty sack of poop. All right. South Interstate 1 still. I did go in 1050 with his vehicle. He just lost control. He's spinning out. He's spinning out. Box him in, dude. Here we go. Yep. Out of the vehicle, sir. Get out of the car. Get your hands up. Put your hands up now. Get on the ground. Get on your knees. Get down. Do it now. Do it now. Stay down. Do not move. Alright, vehicle's gonna be clear at this time. Gonna have one individual on the ground at this time. Going in for cuffs. Alright, I got him. Gonna have one in custody this time. Dispatch. Code 1, code 4. I can't believe it, dude. Alright, sir. Come on with me here. Let me go and get uh, traffic slowed right now. I'm gonna go and stop it, actually, for right now. Just so we can figure life out. And then we'll get it moving again. Alright. Sir, do you have anything illegal on you right now? Let me know. Anything illegal on you I need to know about? We're gonna get you off the freeway, so... You're harmless? Okay, well... Let's find out. I wanna clean this up as soon as possible so I don't have people hitting each other, which... They are, for some reason. They're just, like, right outside of the circle, so they all hit each other. Come on. Okay, nothing too crazy. Go and get him in the back of my car now, and we're gonna get off the freeway. Put him in the car. Yeah, go back to the hood, dude. I can't believe my eyes. Neither can I. Come on. I got money too, motherfucker. All right, hop in the back. All right, beautiful. So, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and see if I can push this vehicle here off to the side of the road. If I can, that'll be great. If not, not the end of the world. But traffic is messing up, dude. Relax, please. Let me see if I can just come back here a little bit and then stop it again. I don't know, dude. Alright, here we go. Nope, not gonna happen. Alright, this vehicle might still be on, so if it is, I'm just gonna back it up. Um, we'll see here. Yeah, it looks like it is. Okay, so vehicle's still on, so I'm gonna back it up here in the number one lane. And we're gonna proceed with our investigation from there. And then shut down this lane. Because we need to open up the freeway for sure, but... Alright, so we're gonna go ahead and block this off a little bit back here, I'd say. So this will be blocked off. Alright. And we'll go and get some cones. Down this way. And then we'll just align this way down here with some cones. I hope that vehicle does not despawn. Alright, beautiful. Not sure what the troopers got going on here, but, you know, whatever. Okay, so, I think it's control F10. Yeah. Let's go and remove all. Uh-oh. Oh, stop all. No, remove all. Limit traffic speed. That. Uh-oh. What did I do? Hit something. No, F10. Oops. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna limit this down to... Let's do... Okay, it looks like 20 is gonna be okay. So that'll be that. We'll be fine. Alright, look at this, dude. This is sick. Alright, got a whole freeway shut down right now. This is beautiful. Alright, so he's in the back. He's gonna be in custody. I'm gonna go and search this vehicle and we're gonna get it out of here. And then I'd like to get off the freeway and we'll continue our investigation so we can open this back up. And NHP is just gonna be there for moral support. That'll be about it. I need to fix my sound. You can still, like, you can't hear all these cars driving by. I think it's because of the siren I have in. I'm not sure. Alright, a suicide vest in there, so I'm gonna go and get a uh, tow service. Out for this, we'll get a small tow truck. Assistance That'll be that. And okay. So there is the small tow truck. And we'll go ahead and hop on over here real quick. Okay. So I'm just going to do that. Perfect. Let's go and get this taken care of now. We'll get off the freeway. I'm just going to turn on my back lights here while I get out of there. We'll go ahead and clear that. Alright, we're going to head over here and we will now go ahead and... Uh, 
take care of this guy's information and stuff, so. I'll just pull up here real quick. We'll hand him off to LVMPD. And then we'll be out of here. So let's go and do that right now, actually. Get a uh, transport. Backup required in all time. All right. He's going to be a J uh, Justice Chance. Interesting name. Uh, he's clean and clear, so we're just going to get him uh, down for resisting arrest and hand it over to them. We'll see what the NHP trooper also wants to put down, if anything. Oh, nice, dude. Silverado. LVMPD. Thank you, man. Appreciate it. Took us all the way out from Nye down here, so... Yeah. Yeah, I'd say so. Alright, thank you, man. Appreciate it. Alrighty, guys, this is going to go and wrap it up for the episode today here of LSPD Far and Nye County Edition. Hope you did enjoy. If you did, make sure to leave a like, subscribe for more. Till next one, guys. Peace out.